This copyrighted telecast is presented by the authority of the Office of the Commissioner of Baseball and may not be reproduced or retransmitted in any form. And the accounts and descriptions of this game may not be disseminated without express written consent. Welcome back to iShine Connect. So then, in episode two of season eight, yeah. the guy has the audacity to go through the time vortex, and I'm just freaking out. I know, I know. He's running through that field full of chickens at the Prince's Palace. It was amazing. I had seen the episode like seven times before, and I still was on the edge of my seat. Yeah. 12 straight hours of that show, my brain hurts. It was 13 hours. Get your facts straight. That's right. Whatever. Copy me, Audrey. Here you go, princess. Mm -hmm. Troy. What are those jalapenos doing here? <laughs> so then he's running through the yard, and there's a whole bunch of chickens in there, and aha! <laughs> Looks like we've got somebody jalapeno handed. Hi, everyone. Michael, I believe I have found the culprit that caused your jalapeno reaction. Sorry, Michael. And I think we also owe you an apology, Max. Yeah, dude, we're sorry. Sorry, too, I am. What? Getting better, my symptoms have become, but an occasional side effect to speak like Yoda, I do. I don't blame you guys. I have a bad reputation, and I'm trying to change that. I'm just glad my name's cleared. Yeah. Oh, uh, Jax, how about you come with me and let's find your little jalapeno poppers, and we have a theater floor to clean, huh? Come on. <laughs> right, Audrey? Yeah. And bring me back some gummy bears. Travel well, my brother. Travel strong, my friend. Hey, Confused in Kentucky, I Shine Academy here. You make a pretty good point about Christianese. You know, believers, Christians, the body of Christ. We say some things that probably sound pretty strange. You know, we forget that we need to speak more clearly around people who don't know Christ or those who are newer to Christ, like you and I, so we don't confuse them and make them not want to learn about Christ completely. It's also important to share stories about Jesus. Just make sure they're your stories. And not those that you've just heard. You see, the stories that you share from your heart are already powerful. No need to spice them up like a jalapeno pepper. <laughs> we at iShine, we're having a blast doing what we're doing. We hope you enjoy the programming. Here's what's really important, that you guys understand how important you are to God. You are so loved, and you are created with a purpose. Here's what I want you to do. I want you to tell your parents what you saw here on television today. Not just what you saw, I want you to talk to them about what you learned. Because you see, your dialogue, your conversations with your parents are so important in helping you really understand what God wants to do in your life. So talk to them and to your parents. I'm a parent too, so I know how crazy life can get. But it is so important that we engage our kids, that we be deliberate about the things that we say and the things that we do. Because we, right now, are forming the people that they are gonna become. By the age of 13, that formation is pretty much set in stone. So we have this time to really help mold a life. It's critical that they understand how much they're loved, not just by you, but by their father. And that's what iShine is all about, is engaging kids under the age of 13 with a message of identity, who they are in Christ. For more information, check us out. Visit us at iShineInfo.com. <laughs>